Morning prayer for Wednesday the 1st of April. We say together the words in yellow. In the name of the Father, the Son and the Holy Spirit. Amen. One thing I have asked of you, Lord, this is what I seek, that I may dwell in your house, O Lord, all the days of my life, to behold your beauty, O Lord, and to seek you in your temple. Who is it that you seek? We seek the Lord our God. Do you seek him with all your heart? Amen. Lord, have mercy. Create in me a pure heart, O God. Do you seek him with all your soul? Amen. Lord, have mercy. As the deer longs for streams of water, so I long for you, O God. Do you seek him with all your mind? Amen. Lord, have mercy. May I be transformed by the renewing of my mind. Do you seek him with all your strength? Amen. Christ, have mercy. May I find new strength in you, Lord, and soar high on wings like eagles. Almighty and everlasting God, creator and sustainer of the universe, we worship you. To whom shall we go? You are the way, the truth and the life, and we have believed and have come to know that you are the Holy One of God, the King of endless glory. Lord Jesus Christ, Saviour and Lord of the world, we worship you. Spirit of the living God, fall afresh on me. Spirit of the living God, fall afresh on me. Break me, melt me, mould me, fill me. Spirit of the living God, fall afresh on me. Holy Spirit, sanctifier of the people of God, we worship you. And now a time of private confession. Our daily devotion today is based on a picture from Neil. And when he sent me the picture, it was his first effort of the week, filled with hope, he says. And the picture is entitled, New Forest, New Day. We have a reading from Lamentations, chapter three, verses 22 to 23. The steadfast love of the Lord never ceases. His mercies never come to an end. They are new every morning. Great is your faithfulness. And as you look at this picture, might God be saying something to you through it? Let's spend some time now just focusing to see if God might want to speak to us. Wednesday's Community Blessing. We bless in the name of the Lord, all in our community with sufficient provision to live happy and healthy lives. 
In Jesus' name, we ask for the provision of wealth and its release in overcoming poverty. That each person would have enough to live and enough to give. We pray God's blessing on the work of each person's hand and that in whatever you turn your hand to, it will be wholesome and profitable. We bless in the name of the Lord every wholesome enterprise that is conducted within our community, that it may be successful and prosper. This to include every shop, restaurant, pub, club and business that legitimately operates for the benefit of the community. And today we pray for Kathleen, David and Robert. And our prayer road for the day is Abbott Corner, which can be found just off Dudley Close. Christ as a light, illumine and guide me. Christ as a shield, overshadow me. Christ under me. Christ over me. Christ beside me on my left and my right. This day be within and without me. Lowly and meek, yet all-powerful. Be in the heart of each to whom I speak, in the mouth of each who speaks unto me. This day be within and without me, lowly and meek, yet all-powerful. Christ as a light, Christ as a shield, Christ beside me on my left and my right. Heavenly Father, we pray that this day we may live in your presence and please you more and more. Lord Jesus Christ, we pray that this day we may take up our cross and follow you. Holy Spirit, we pray that this day your fruit may ripen in our lives. Love, joy, peace patience, kindness, goodness, faithfulness, gentleness and self-control. The blessing. May the peace of the Lord Christ go with you, wherever he may send you. May he guide you through the wilderness, protect you through the storm. May he bring you home rejoicing at the wonders he has shown you. May he bring you home rejoicing once again into our doors. And we end our time of morning prayer by saying together, in the name of the Father, the Son and the Holy Spirit. Amen. <laughs>